Hello, my name is Krzysztof Grabowski. I'm a technical solution specialist from these guys. And uh, today I wanted to show you our new product, which is the Omnical system. So to better explain why we've created Omnical, I'm going to start with what is these guys and how it actually works. Uh, we are using 3D environment, uh, especially for a projection mapping projects. And we have 3D workflow. Uh, and this 3D workflow allows us to overcome lots of challenges. However, if the 3D model that we base on, uh, that we are using for a projection is not correct in our 3D workflow, this is what might happen. Bad projection calibration might happen because we are not able to calibrate the 3D environment and therefore the projection itself. So, how to improve existing workflows? The Omnical is a system that is designed to fix these problems mentioned earlier with inaccurate projection calibration, also with, not, with short time boundaries for complex, pro, for complex projects. And Omnical is fixing these pro, this problems by fixing 3D environment we are working in so we can deliver the creative visions with exceptional quality and also saving time. The system is designed to give the software ability to see the stage and what's happening on the stage. It's a new projection workflow. It's an alternative to existing one uh, and it fits nicely within the current disguise methodology. So what is the workflow itself? It's the best to explain the workflow to understand how the system really works and how it overcomes these challenges. So first of all, we start with simulated camera plan, which as these guys we want to pre be prepared beforehand for the projects. This is why if we use a camera based calibration system, we need to know how many cameras do we need and where to place them. After we've simulated where to place the cameras, and how to place them, we actually mount them in real environment. We can compare if the alignment of the virtual world and the real world is matching, and we mount the cameras. So we adjust all the settings, we can see it in the software, and uh, we will be collecting later on offline images to use for the calibration itself. The next step is the capture. In the capture, we are displaying structured light patterns onto the objects and capturing these images through the cameras. Uh, this, is the, this is very short amount of time because usual projection alignment, it might take up to several hours. This process takes minutes. And this is the sample of the alignment. So this is how it looks like in the real world. Uh, after the alignment is done, uh, after the capture process is done, we begin to calculate the 3D world, including the projector placement, including the 3D meshes that are present in our world, and the camera placement. So after we've done it, The system gives us ability to see whether the 3D stage is correct or not. As you can see, if I zoom in, I have a flat screen. However, it's just showing you the example of how the system might work. I have a flat screen and a 3D mesh that shows me it's not accurate. What we'll do later on, we're going to fix it. The next step in the workflow itself, since we already know where the projectors and the cameras are, we proceed to alignment. So we are simply dragging and dropping points on offline images. We are not using the objects on stage anymore. We are using only the images captured through the cameras. It requires minimum of three points three points per camera and minimum of two cameras to align the objects in three-dimensional space. So after we've done this, we face the 
last and the most important problem. What if the mesh we have is not accurate and is different? The system is capable of creating new 3D object out of the old object and the information gathered in the capture process. So what might happen, how we might fix it, we'll see in a minute. So we can create new object right now and uh, therefore the whole 3D environment is fixed. So the same workflow applies to two projectors and 20 projectors. If the 3D environment is fixed, it doesn't matter how many projectors are we calibrating because we are calibrating them all at the same time. Just to quickly summarize OmniCalcu attributes, we are accurately calibrating all projectors to sub-pixel accuracy. Uh, the system is scalable, so whether it's 2 or 20 projectors or 4 or 20 cameras, it's possible to the, we can deliver it. Also, it's time-saving because, well, if it's, a, if it's a two projectors right now, we can do it with the conventional methods. However, if the time boundaries are very short and this is a special project, there might be simply not enough time to calibrate large quantity of projectors. We are fixing 3D environment, not warping the outputs of the projectors because we don't want to break the 3D world. Uh, the workflow is integrated within the current these guys workflow, so it's not something entirely new. It's something that sits nicely together. And we have flexible hardware solutions depending on the project itself, whether it's concert touring that requires quick setup and then we have to remove the cameras from the stage, or if it's a permanent installation uh, with different lenses options, we, we have hardware solution for everything. If you'd like to know more about Omnical, please get in touch and uh, visit our website 